फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू कोडिंग ब्लॉग्स जूनियर आई एम सिमरिंग योर मेंटर फॉर टुडे एंड दिस वीडियो इज पार्ट थ्री ऑफ गेम टेम्पल रन वी वर बिल्डिंग इन जीरा ब्लॉक फाइव सो इन दिस सेशन वी आर एक्चुअली गोइंग टू टेक अ लिटल बिट हायर वी आर गोइंग टू एड सम कोइंस वी गोइंग टू एड सम ग्लोबल वेरिएबल्स एनिमीज एंड सो या एड स्कोर्स ऑब्वियसली सो या सो लेट्स जू स्टार्ट एंड लेट्स गेट इन टू इट So the first thing we'll do is add a new object since we add we want to add coins. So we we'll go to tile sprite and we'll edit this and we'll say coin. I'm gonna select an image. We'll choose a new image and coin gold. Perfect and. Let's just increase its size to seventy six by seventy six, and we're gonna apply it. Okay, so the next thing we need to add is okay. So we added our coin. Now we just placed it on locations like this, right? So you can place it anywhere you'd like. I'm just placing it on random locations right now. I think this will be enough. Right. Okay, so we've added our coin. Now what? So coins so add ho gaye. Like now we collect the coins and the score increases like there should be a score. How do we add a score? So we'll add a new object. We'll go to text because uh it's a score is a text that displays over our screen so i'm going to call it score we have to increase its size to a whole lot 100 so that we are able to see it properly and we're going to keep it bold and apply so as you can see we have added our score text now we'll just place it over right here okay so let's just hit a preview and see Okay, it is here, but it is somewhere until we jump. Only then I can see it, right? So the first thing we'll do is we'll place this text over here. Okay, in the rightmost, uh, sorry, leftmost corner, and then. since this this uh like the camera of our game is actually focused on our player because it is the most important thing but we want to see the score at all times so what we need to do is we need to add a layer so we we'll go over this and we will click on add layer and we will add a layer and we'll keep its name to gy okay we'll close this Now this can you see this base layer? Now we'll what we'll actually do is we'll keep it to GUI. And now when we hit a preview, okay, wrong game window. It was supposed to go over here. Perfect. Now let's hit a preview. Yes, as you can see, we are able to see our text at all times. Right. Okay. So the next thing we need to do is, so we added our score, right? So we want to collect these coins. How would we collect them? We need to go to events. We'll add a group event called score. Let's move it at the bottom. We'll call it score. Okay. So what will the condition to be for collecting coins? How will we collect collect coins? So add condition. Collision only here. कोलेजन प्लेयर की कॉइन के साथ क्वाइट ऑफिस ओके देन एक्शन वॉट विल द एक्शन विल बी वी नीड टू डिलीट द कॉइन्स सिंस वो कॉइन्स तो प्लेयर खा गया राइट द प्लेयर के पास प्लेयर ने खा लिए या फिर प्लेयर ले गया उन्हें सो वी नीड टू डिलीट कॉइन और शुड बी डिलीट द प्लेयर नो वी डिलीट द कॉइन ओके सो ना वी क्लिक ऑन ओके एंड वील हिट अ प्रिव्यूएंसी Okay, you know what? We'll see the preview in the last. So delete कर दिया कॉइन अब स्कोर कैसे बढ़ाए स्कोर तो सिर्फ नॉर्मल टेक्स्ट है जिसपे सिर्फ टेक्स्ट लिखा हुआ है सो so, उसके लिए हम यहाँ पे प्रोजेक्ट मैनेजर में जाएंगे हम गेम सेटिंग्स में जाएंगे हम ग्लोबल वेरिएबल्स में 
and then we will add a variable named score and we're going to keep its value at zero and we'll apply it and then we need to do is here we add an action that uh, variables global variable value of a global variable so variable is called score we want to add one to the variable whenever we eat a coin or collect a coin right so now what we want to do is we also want to change the text and how will we do that so we'll just add a new event we'll just simply add an action for that and that will be modify the text of our global variable so score sorry modify the text of our object text object which is uh, which is going to be set to and the value would be yahan se select karke hum variable select kar lenge so we'll go to variables text of a global variable which variable score apply right here and okay now we'll see our game as you can see yahan pe zero aa raha hai aur jaise hi isse collide kar raha hai this is one so perfect right so now what we need to do is यहाँ पे सिर्फ जीरो वन आ रहा है कैसे पता लगेगा ये क्या है सो so, यहाँ पे हम क्लिक करोगे यहाँ पे डबल स्ट्रिंग्स स्कोर दिस वन अस अलन इन दिस प्लस एंड स्पेस राइट हियर एंड वील प्रेस ओके नाउ वेन वी हिट द प्री व्यू परफेक्ट राइट सो दिस इज है सो कूल जॉब राइट कूल थिंग्स स्कोरिंग हो गई अब मुझे क्या चाहिए अब मुझे मेरी गेम में एक एनिमी भी चाहिए राइट सो इसको इन सबको डालते हैं स्कोरिंग में इसको करते हैं मिनिमाइज लेट्स गो डू अ न्यू सीन एंड वी विल एड अ न्यू ऑब्जेक्ट दैट विल बी अ स्प्राइट एंड इट्स नेम आई गोन कीप इट एनिमी और यू कैन कीप इट ई विल एनिमी For animation, we we'll click on Add Animation. We'll click on Add. Don't worry, guys. I'll be sharing all of these assets with you on the Discord uh, server. So make sure you join our Discord server. The link is in the description. Okay. So ये जो आप error देख uh, error तो नहीं एक kind of reminder देख रहे हो it's because क्योंकि मेरे जो जी डब्ल्यू के प्रोजेक्ट्स हैं वो कहीं और सेव हो रहे हैं और मेरे जो एसेट्स हैं वो कहीं और है सो दैट इज़ वाई वो मेरे को बोल रहा है कि इसकी डुप्लीकेट कॉपी बनानी पड़ेगी मुझे सो दैट्स फाइन विद मी सो आई एम जस्ट प्रेसिंग ओके सो इफ यू डोंट वॉन्ट दिस थिंग यू कैन प्लेस योर एसेट्स इन योर जी डब्ल्यू एफ प्रोजेक्ट फोल्डर एंड इट वोट शो इट अगेन ओके so we need to make it a loop we'll see our preview okay isko decrease kar dete hain seven pe perfect and we'll apply it right enemy ho gaya what is the next thing we need to do so the next thing we need to do is we need to add another thing which will be called as so first we need to add actually an object variable to enemy object variables this is particularly is is ek object ka this is objects Our enemy is an object. उसका variable is an object variable, right? So I'm going to name it direction because this is going to handle the direction of our enemy, okay? And I'm going to keep it to the left because the uh, animation is in uh, is moving. Uh, sorry, is facing towards left, right? So apply. So this is our enemy. Perfect. यार इतना छोटू सा enemy. प्रीव्यू देख के देखते हैं बहुत ही छोटू सा लग रहा है तो नहीं तो बड़ा है काफी बड़ा है ओके सो द नेक्स्ट थिंग वी नीड टू डू इज वी एक्चुअली नीड टू ऐड डायरेक्शन फॉर दैट वी जस्ट गोन एड सम स्प्राइट्स एंड आई एम गोन कीप द ऑब्जेक्ट नेम एज एनिमी लेफ्ट Okay, and for animation, I'm going to edit with this skill. So you're going to see this also for the first time. So left is towards left, yeah, right. So I'm just going to do this, and I'm going to do this. So this is left, perfect. I'm going to save it and apply. So we got enemy left, right? So left is this, ha, huh? perfect. And we'll add a new object, right? 
I am going to name it as enemy right. अरे right के spelling गलत हो गए. Add an animation. Add out with this color again. I am going to make right as this side right. So just like that. इसका कोई फर्क नहीं पड़ता आप कैसे बना रहे हो बट इफ़ यू आर नेचुरली गुड एट ड्राइंग वेल एंड गुड इफ़ यू आर नॉट डोंट वरी अगर आप मेरी तरह हो इट्स ओके बिकॉज ये आर इन दी एंड एक्चुअली में हम इसे हाइड कर देंगे राइट सो ये एक्चुअली में दिखेंगे नहीं तो इसीलिए हम ऐसा कर रहे हैं ठीक है सो हम जिसको ना अप्लाई इट ओके नाउ वी वॉन्ट आर एनिमी टू मूव फ्रॉम दिस पार्ट ऑफ द पोजिशन टू दिस पार्ट ऑफ द पोजिशन सो वट वी गोइंग टू डू इज वी गोइंग टू Add new events, so I'm just gonna go to group, and I'm gonna add the name as enemy. Right. So for that, we'll add a new event. What will the event be? So the event would be if the direction, if the direction variable is left, so move towards left. And how would we do that? So first of all, we need to check. Uh, so we'll just go to conditions, variables. Uh, it's not here, so let's just type text of an object variable. We got it. So what is the object? The object is enemy. What is the variable? It's called direction, and we want to set it. Uh, we want to uh, set to value to compare would be left. So if it is already left, so we want to move it towards left. How will we move it? We want to add a force, so we'll add a force. So I'm gonna choose add a force, normal add a force, this one. So what to what? This one. And if we want to move towards left, so x-axis is like this, right? So this is the negative x-axis and this is the positive x-axis. So towards left, that means I need to go to towards negative x-axis. So I'm just gonna make it to one uh, 80 pixels, minus 80 pixels per second. Speed of zero? No, we don't want any speed in the y direct uh, y axis. So we're gonna keep it to that, and we'll add another uh, event, and we're just gonna copy this, paste it here, copy this. Okay. So copy this and paste it here. But here we will change it to uh, to right. So we're gonna keep it as right. And instant force of now it's going to be plus eighty because we need to move towards right. So this is negative, this is positive, right? So this positive that means this side, right means positive. So let's hit a preview and see. Okay, so as you can see, it still keeps on moving towards this direction, right? So we need something so that it can change its direction by when it hits the right uh, right direction arrow and when it hits the left direction arrow. So okay, so we'll add a new event. That event will be uh, condition will be collision. Collision between what? So the collision is actually going to be in between enemy and let's keep it to enemy right first. Okay. So for enemy right, we want to keep. Sorry, this one's going to be perfect. We're going to flip our animation. So, we're, uh, sorry, we're going to flip our object. Flip the object horizontally. Which object? Enemy. Activate flipping in right. Yes, we need to because it's going towards left. And what other thing we need to add in here is we need to add an action that it is going to change change the uh, modif modify. Are modify the text of which object? Okay, so this is the text object. Sorry. So we're going to do object variable. Text of an object variable. So we want to change the text. So we'll just go to enemy variable will be direction, and we want to set it to. Since it's going, uh, it's left, uh, right. So I'm just gonna keep it to right. Right, and we'll just copy, copy this, 
copy this whole event and we'll paste this and we'll copy this to paste it copy this to and it's going to be pasted over here array paste it now yahan pe enemy right ki jagah yahan pe actually enemy left se hoga and enemy left mein hame kuch nahi karna so we're going to keep it to no and yahan pe set it to left Perfect, right? So let's hit the preview and see now. Perfect, so it is working, right? So what we want to do is now this is working, right? So our enemy has gone. Everything is working fine. But now we need to see that if our enemy actually collides with our player, then our player will die. and so let's just add a condition overacting movie sorry so we're going to add collision and collision between what player and what object enemy okay so add an action that will be delete our object player This should happen only when. So, एक मैं ये भी चाहती हूँ कि हमारा एनिमी भी तो कभी मरना चाहिए फेयर कॉम्पिटिशन होना चाहिए ना सो मैं क्या चाहती हूँ कि एक्चुअली में जब हमारा प्लेयर हमारे एनिमी पे कूद जाए तो हमारा एनिमी मर जाना चाहिए अब कूदने के लिए फॉलिंग वाला यूज होगा तो यहाँ पे भी हमें कंडीशन डालनी चाहिए ना कि अगर फ्लोर पे है तभी एनिमी मर, प्लेयर मरेगा अगर वो उस, अगर फॉल कर रहा है तो नहीं तो नहीं मर सकता हमारा प्लेयर तो इट्स गोइंग टू बी ऑल राइट एंड एनिमी मर जाएगा तो ये We're gonna press OK and add a new event. That event is going to be collision between player and enemy. Okay, and we'll delete the enemy now. We'll uh, okay here. Okay, but this is only going to happen when is falling. When our player is actually falling on enemy. Right, so this this is okay. Now let's hit a preview and let's see our game. This is the final one. We just need to make one more change and we'll be all right. Maria, perfect. So this is also working. Now, in sab ko pehle to align kar dete hain. Right, so that hum ise minimize kar paaye. Grouping is actually a really good practice to save your time and save the space of your screen, like work screen, right? So actually, when starting of the screen, uh, scene at the beginning of the scene, मैं क्या चाहती हूँ कि हमारे जो हमने arrows बनाए थे ना, वो hide हो जाएँ. So we're gonna hide. अरे नहीं 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 नहीं. Left. Yup, and I'm just gonna copy this and paste it over here. And enemy left ki jagah ho jayega. Enemy, sorry, right, this one, perfect. Or because it's at the beginning, so we'll put it at the beginning. Now, this is the last final shot. Are you ready? Here we go, 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 and yay! Okay, perfect. So as you can see now, everything works very well. So for the for the homework for this part three, your homework is going to be actually making all of this and make sure you submit on the Google form. Uh, which will be provided on the discord server as well so and if you have any doubt please feel free to uh, contact me and in th so in the discord server as well so and for more fun coding and gaming please uh, subscribe to channel coding blocks junior and make sure you follow us on all social media platforms thank you so much bye bye